So, it's 2022. The industry portfolio tasting phenomenon has returned. Now, I know it may sound like a lot of fun, but picture a giant room with hundreds of tables, each of which has dozens of wines to taste. If that wasn't overwhelming enough, factor in hundreds of other attendees who you're constantly jockeying for position with in relation to the pour behind the table and the spittoon off on the side. And then you take into account the fact that many of those attendees are not interested in the spittoon at all and are there just to have a good time. And also, they're there to talk at each other loud enough so that everyone within a quarter mile knows what cool people they hang out with and what amazing bottles they got to crush on somebody else's dime. For me, it means I'm trying to get in and out as quickly as possible. Of course, grabbing that free coffee on the way out. But they do serve a purpose. That's why I always end up going to a lot of them. Sometimes you find something brand new that you can't wait to share with your customers. And sometimes you wander over to the table of a beloved producer whose wines you've adored for decades at this point, and you find the perfect wine that you just can't wait to offer out to your customers. At the Boulder tasting a few weeks ago, I found exactly that wine. Bernard Baudry's Chinon Le Grezo 2019 in a magnum format. And I was instantly basking in the glow of dark, juicy, mineral, herbaceous, just joyously generous Cabernet Franc from the Loire. And it was enough to make all those annoyances from a moment before just kind of dissipate. And what's better than that? Well, the magnum format, which means it's perfect for sharing with your good friends who don't annoy you. Seated around a beautiful meal under a warm sky some summer evening, I'm telling you. It's a wine like this that makes things like the portfolio tasting totally worth it. A magnum of Chinon.